Hi guys, um, I'm just going to show you a quick little thing about how to download the rule book in the um, 3008 wiring rules book or any um, trade um, books you need for example of uh, online standards. So what you do is you go into student web, BHI, you type that in, you log in and then up in the left hand corner here we see my library, my stuff. Okay, so you log in. All right, you can see you're logged into this part. You'll have your dashboard. I go up to my library here. I click on it and it brings up a catalog. All right, welcome to the library, keyword search. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna look for a thing called databases. Click on databases and it brings up a list, okay? So what we're gonna do is we're gonna walk down the list to standards online so once we get the standards online we click on it and it asks us to type in a normal password like we do for bhi which it says me so i have to type in my new one again and correct all right so just bear with me for a sec bear with me Sorry about that. So, if we have a bit of a look. Okay, conditions of use. All right, a bit hard to kind of see at the moment, but anyway, continues the standards online. And it brings up, uh, where are we there? Conditions of use. So we've done that, clicked in SIA Global here. So I'm going to type in 3008 AS3008 and go search. We'll do. And guess what? There's a new rule book. Search is there. We go to view document. All right, but look, all I have to do is just hit. Click on here, all right, it'll start thinking about it. It brings it all up. Here's a book, the last one done. I want to view document, so we'll do that. All right, it's going through, and brings up the old ones. What have we got? Are we viewing or not? Okay. Just get it back a sec. Um, it takes a bit. So I've gone back. Right, here we go. So I've got it open. It says open document or save this to thing. What I normally do is just want to open it up first, have a quick look. Make sure we got the right one, Australian New Zealand Standard. Okay, sorry. Cable selections for Australian installation conditions, not New Zealand, Australian. Okay, so once I've got it and it's downloaded, I can come up the corner here and I go to download. I hit download. All right, it'll ask me where to save it to. So I'm gonna just save it to my desktop. This one here. And I hit save, and guess what? It's saved to my desktop. Done. Easy peasy, like winner winner chicken dinner. Okay, have a crack at that and see how you go.